welcome back here, hockey fans across Canada. And welcome to Hockey Night in Canada here for Game 4 of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. And off we go. Game 4 Stanley Cup Playoffs. First round between the Outlaws and the Kings. And off we go. The series is a 2-1 lead for the Outlaws. And here is Arms. Here is the big fella, Fretch. And oh, just mauling him in the corner. And a dandy of a hit of a, of a mauling it was. And a chance. Here are the Kings. Oh, what a move. Scars. Oh, what a dandy of a move. Oh, baby. The one hand talk. Adopted by the man himself. Pavel Dasuk, I believe, and what a goal that was by the Kings, by the Kings captain, and totally fooled the goaltender over to Armstrong, and a trip is coming up, and it's a penalty shot, <clears throat> well it was a trip by the, by the, uh, and here he is. It was a trip by the Kings and Armstrong here. Pretty good in his career. Had a good move and he was stopped by the goaltender on the penalty shot. He made a good move. It was just a good stop by Lockhart on the play. 6.27 to go. A good chance. A quick shot. What a chance that was for Big Fretch. And Saros. And another break for Armstrong. Charles! What a move! That was as well. It seems that all the angles have come out in this one. And it's a 1 1 game here. The Outlaws have tied this up here with five to go in the period. Well, it was a good play by Saros. A good play by Saros. And a big hit by. And here is Fretch. Fretch. He's going to try and give it over to Armstrong, and that will do it for the period. The score in this one 1 to 1 after 1. Here. Back up here on Coach's Corner to Don and Ron for Coach's Corner. And we will see you in the second period of this hockey game here on Hockey Night in Canada. And here we are for the second period. Here between your dad's Lofas, the Kings, and the Ottawa Valley Outlaws, or the Junior Outlaws, sorry, here in game four of the first round of the 2019 Stanley Cup playoffs. It's 1 1, it's 2 1 in the series. Armstrong busting through the neutral zone. And a pin up against the boards. And a chance. It's a break for the Kings. Here he is. What a move. Scars. What a move that was by the Kings. On the breakaway. And the Kings have regained the lead. And it's 2-1 to one in this hockey game. And it was Bosi with the dirty dangle. And he beat the goaltender on the backhand after the dangle. Oh, and he fanned on the shot. He missed a, a shot. Oh, what a chance it was. Back to Saros. Saros over to Armstrong's cars. A great passing play by the Outlaws. And they respond like last time. It was a great play by, by Saros to keep it in. And Armstrong was on the other side for a big, big fretch who's hard to take off the puck. He passed it over to Armstrong, and Armstrong took the quick release shot. And he beat the goaltender for a second of the night. Oh, baby, was that a nice shot. A nice goal for the Outlaws. Fratch seemed confused on the play. And I believe that's a penalty. 
coming up here. 9.30 to go. And seems that they're going to try and hold on to it here and set it up. And here is Fetch with the shaft. And a penalty shaft coming up here again. The second penalty shot for the Outlaws. And it's going to be Big Fretch. 6'9", 270 pounds. Let's see what he's got. Fretch. Oh, what a save. What a move by Fretch. It's hard to believe that a big fella such as Fretch had those dangles and was managing to pull it off. He wasn't quick on the play. It was just a good move, but... A better stop by the goaltender. And another two penalty shot saves for him tonight. And my oh my again. Fretch wearing the Jofa. Oh again what a hit by Fretch. He's a one man wrecking machine. It's He's like a wall out there Jim. He just, he's out there. Just annihilating guys. Fretch with the shot. And that will do the period. The score, two to two. And Fretch looks in disgust as he missed the net by 400 trucks in length. And off we go again. Didn't seem like much of an intermission. I just got to sit down there for my apple fritter and coffee. And I didn't even get to finish it. And here we go, but that's okay. Here we go. Seros. Oh, what a hit. He sat the big boy down. And here it comes. Jim, imagine getting hit by this guy. 6'9", 275 pounds. Of pure largeness. Where to hit me? Oh, what a shot, what a stop. It was. And there. And a good pass. What a pass it was. And here's Armstrong trying to find the big guy. He took the shot. And it was a stop by Lockhart once again. He's had a good game in this one. And here's the dirty dangler. The goaltender of the outlaws. Well, look at that hit. That was just a large hit on the big fella and those Jofas don't have too much coverage to the head anymore compared to what they're normally wearing he must be 600 years of age like I said to be wearing that Saros a quick shot and here is Kurt and oh what a hit what a booming clapper that was and the fans must be going wild here in Ottawa that might be the proximate play here in this one and up the center, he knows he needs to be giving it over to Armstrong and another chance. Here is Kurtz. Kurtz with a shot. Nearly was the end of the game, but it looks to be going to overtime. For the second time in this series, it will be going to the overtime session. And the heroics were fresh on the penalty shot last game to win it. To make it 2-1 in the series here in the EA Sports Hockey League Stanley Cup Playoffs. And we're back. Hockey fans here from Canada. And here we are. Hockey Night in Canada. Live coverage of this Game 4 between the Outlaws and the, and the, and the Kings. Up comes the Kings. Saros with the big hit. And out the play of Buck. Oh! I don't even know what happened on that play. It was a big mistake by King, and it seems that he collided with his own player. Oh baby, that was a really weird play, wasn't it? Oh, what a bad giveaway by Fretch. Oh, what a stop by King. It seemed that they called the play down on the last play. Sorry, my old age is Getting the best of me here. I forgot to finish off my thought. But what I was trying to say here in this hockey game is they called it off due to the 
goalie's mask being taken off. Busting through the neutral zone, given away by the Kings. Going to the net is Armstrong. He shoots, scores! The deflection goal with his big presence and his big long reach by big fella French. What a goal! He, it was a shot by Armstrong. He's been a great playmaker tonight. And he took the shot, and our big French went to the net, and Lockhart couldn't see over the brick wall. Of course he wouldn't be able to see with that big, tall, wide load. And a great chance. And a great goal. What a game. And the Outlaws, again with the game, with the heroics. French with the game-winning whole heroics for the second game in a row. Game four, taken by the Outlaws, 3-1 to one in the series. And we will see you in game five here to see if the Outlaws can finish it off. And that's all for now, for now here on Coach's Corner and Hockey Night in Canada. So long, and we'll see you in the next one. This is Bob Cole signing out, hockey fans from Canada. Oh, baby, what a night it was, it was tonight with another Outlaws win.